guys I was on YouTube recently and just somehow got hooked into the uh, BET um, YouTube channel and they have all of those new edition clips from their uh, mini series they had on in January and I don't even know how I missed that mini series I used to love new edition it was so awesome but um, I really wish I had seen it I feel like I'm the only person who didn't see it and um, I went to their website to try and watch it there but my cable provider is right now not uh, connected with them so I couldn't. I'm really hoping that they play it again or better yet license it to Netflix for you know a few weeks so I can just binge watch the whole thing because I don't like doing it one night and then the next night and then the next night I'm like come on I want to see this now but there are a lot of things on there that I really didn't know like I was a big Bobby Brown fan. I saw a new edition when um, they were all still together and Bobby Brown was still in the group, like before Johnny Gill. And he was my favorite because by that point he was doing all of his extra stuff that they talked about. And he was just my favorite one because he was just so awesome. And um, they all were though. And uh, so when he left the group, I was like, oh, he, I'm thinking he left on his own to become the solo person. Only to find out from watching these clips that they had actually kicked him out. So then when Johnny Gill showed up, I thought he was there to replace Bobby Brown. And I liked Johnny Gill when he was doing his solo thing. So I had this, oh, Johnny Gill thinks he's going to replace Bobby Brown, no way, kind of vibe towards him. Even though I still liked him. But turns out he was actually there to, to replace Ralph because Ralph was thinking about leaving or something. I don't know. It was just so, like, mind-blowing. Like, oh, I didn't know all of this stuff was going on. Then I see the recent interviews with them and how close they actually are. And I just think that's amazing that all of these years, I think they've been together since their late 70s, early 80s. And they're still like, the, you know, these are my brothers and they, they still talk and they still communicate. They still hang out with each other. And I just think that is so awesome. How many groups do you know are like that? Like they fuss, they fight, but so do families. They fuss, they fight, but they still love each other. And I just think that's so awesome. But um, I, like I said, I feel like I'm the only person who didn't see this. So BET, put it on Netflix. And you know, you got me, alright? Check each other. Bye.